sound good? All right. Apparently. Good? We'll fix it in post. Welcome to Drunken Commentary. This is a special Drunken Commentary. I've got four people here. So this is going to be like a riff tracks kind of thing. Yeah, uh, you got to <laughs> pop in your Vinegar Syndrome <laughs> version of Madman if you really want to watch with us. But Madman, what can we say? Brent, have you seen this movie before? I believe I have, but my brain has deleted it. <laughs> I don't know. I don't that know how well. that happened I mean, with Brent. <laughs> Rob, you have never seen it, right? I've never seen it. But I did show you the hot tub scene. Probably. Oh, okay. Yes, yes. Have you seen the hot tub scene? Right, okay, so this is... You've got the post, though, of course. Right, thanks to Charlie Hours, I have the Style B poster of uh, Madman in my room. Yes. So this is the one that Charlie and I wanted to do for a while, but then the Quigley Mobile was uh, out of commission for a really long time, so. Yeah, but two now months, it's Jesus it's Christ. Yeah. Good shit. It takes him two months to fix it. But... Yeah. And the horn, I gotta, you, remind me, I gotta honk the horn for you guys before I leave. It's hilarious. I think, I think it got dented, and anyways. Right. The Quigley Mobile is because I'm very you know. Fucking curious. It sounds fucking. It's hilarious. It sounds like a clown horn. <laughs> <laughs> so, so most people have like you know pictures and selfies with like celebs or whatever. But Charlie, to commemorate the fact that he actually had a scream queen in his car, had Linnea Quigley sign the dashboard and had an accident. Not his fault. Some other dumbass. Fucked it up, and it's been in the shop. And it was three years to the day that Linnea signed it, which is really weird. So, man, you gotta be a, you gotta be aware on these mean streets, yo. I shouldn't, right. I shouldn't even be. These, these, I'm not even gonna drive it on the Savage street. streets. Yeah. yeah, Savage streets. Is <laughs> which is the other one we want to do for? Yeah, uh, uh, I see what uh, you uh, did uh, there, you crafty. I know, I know. I know. So the reason why uh, Charlie's holding a bottle of J&B whiskey, there is uh, a, an app called Letterboxd, if you are not familiar, and um, we are both on it. I don't know what, you're what, toxic, you're the toxic... I think I'm just Charlie Hours on there. Okay. I'm Rebecca Reinhardt on there, and we have started some lists, well, they're on Charlie's, but I've taken to <laughs> making my life's work. So, um... So one of the things is movies with a bottle of J&B whiskey in it. You would be amazed how many bottles of J&B whiskey are in movies. Uh, we have that cat clock. So that like kind of Fritz the cat looking clock where it's like the tail wags and the eyes go back and forth. That's another one. Uh, the peacock chair, which is that like wicker throne that everybody had. I'm really liking that one. Yeah, and it's fun when you spot this shit. Uh, boom in the frame. Yeah, it could be a shadow or an actual boom. Uh, people being taken advantage of in wheelchairs. Right, so of course, Mark, right, that's the part you could have started it. Uh, uh, movies where people say homes 456 times. Right, which has exactly one movie. On There's it. only one movie so far. Yeah. Okay. There might be more. Homes? Homes, like the Spanish, yeah, like, like, like Mexican. What's up, home? Yeah. 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 But no way we're playing. I haven't seen Colors Challenge. in a while, so it might be, I'll Colors. have to count the home. Colors. 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 But we were watching <laughs> Cannibal Holocaust the other night, and it was an exciting moment because there was a wall of a JMB whiskey ad and a boom in the shot simultaneously. It was, yeah. It was magical, wasn't it? Was, it was it's a really... fucking book rush, yo. Yeah. <laughs> and in Caliber 9, um, there's a JMB warehouse. Mm. It's an entire warehouse Ooh. of just J&B crates. Now, what movie did you watch recently that had like four of our criteria? Oh yeah, oh my gosh, what was that? Um... The movie probably sucked, because you can't even remember, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, the movie wasn't that great. It had like everything. Right. Like, shotgun. <laughs> I was like, did I make this? Because one, it was bad. I could have made it. Because one, it was bad, and two, it had all my things in it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all your little Easter eggs. Yeah. Speaking of something that's bad that I don't think has any of these things in it, we're watching Madman from 1981. So, uh. 1981 was a magical year for horror, especially for slashers. So that year we had Friday the 13th Part 2, The Burning, and Madman, which essentially had the same plot. 
uh, but varying uh, levels of uh, quality. And Mad Men definitely is the one that had the, the smallest about budget. Uh, but it is very charming, at least to, well, to me and Charlie. And as you can hear, the freaking music is awesome. Well, at least this, at least the theme song's awesome. So, I'll do a count of three, you guys have. I'm ready. Okay. Without producer introduction. Yeah, I don't think we need to hear the producer go, yeah, I made this piece of shit. No. That'd be commentary on top of commentary. <laughs> <laughs> He's probably a mob guy, honestly. A lot of those... A lot of those producers in the 80s were like mob men. Yeah. yeah. All said, right. You said the quiet pot out loud. Okay. One, <laughs> two, three, play. Now, this does star, uh, depending upon who you are talking to, Alexis Dubin or Gail, Gail Ross or Gail Janoni. Gil you see his yeah. fucking name is yes. Janone. Janone. I told you. Fucking madman. Yeah. But Alexis Dubin is actually from Indianapolis. And okay. now she goes by Galen Ross. Uh, she was in a few horror movies. She was in Creepshow. We watched that the other night. And she was also in Dawn of the Dead. She's the main girl in that. But she uh, is a documentarian. Like a world-renowned documentarian. Award-winning. And she is in the Indiana Public Schools Hall of Fame. That's cool. And last I checked, uh, you might know, she doesn't talk about this movie. No, no. I think I think she will talk about Dawn of the Dead, but she will not talk about Batman. <laughs> yeah. I don't know why. Hmm. Ah. Uh, no, I see. I love, like, the red. Like, this is very simple with the red. Oh, yeah. Kind of this silhouette is, yeah. of the trees and the scent, the heavy It looks scent. like a pair it's, of snakes. It's so, so far. Like Conan kind of shit. Yeah. Stephen Horlick did the music. Yeah, he, he, like, Giannone, there he is, Joey Giannone, fucking guy, I know that guy. What the fuck in high school was that guy? If you had a uh, less better look to this, I would almost say this is, could be like a shot on video. Yes. So, so far. Right. Now that changes pretty fast. But. Now, it's a, okay, it started during a campfire at North Sea Cottages, a special retreat for gifted children. They had to shoot this so far out of season that it is actually a fall camp for gifted children. <laughs> and we never see the gifted children. There's like six of them. So this is like the Professor Xavier mansion kind of shit. A little bit. Oh my god. Oh. oh, wow. They look like brothers and sisters. Oh, no, no, no. No, no, I, no, no, no. Well, I'll, I'll do a pause later and I will tell you my theory of those two. Those, this this looks disturbingly like Jesus Camp or some shit. Yeah. Well, they're supposed to be gifted children, and they're going home for Thanksgiving break because that's a thing. So why is this fucking weirdo broken everybody? Uh, I think you're talking about TP. Oh yeah. You're gonna see plenty of TP through this movie. Uh, he shows it all. But, you know, a lot of times with uh, horror movies, especially, you don't really see a lot of that male nudity. Yeah. Not this one. Yeah, T.P., Tony oh. Fish, who also is the guy singing right now and sings the the love theme. Hey, guys, turn it down, please. Uh, Put your headphones in, dude. And he has a killer belt buckle. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Yeah, you definitely deleted He reminds me of the fucking venereal disease guy on Fast Times. You know, maybe yes. that's a movie we should make. Kill her belt buckle. Fat venereal disease. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I mean, that was I think this could have been the alternate title for Mad Men, maybe. Yeah. They all kind of look like Italian Americans, too. You know? I don't mean, know what you're fucking talking about. <laughs> Okay, but one thing that I do find charming about this movie, aside from the fact that they give away the entire oh, wow. movie within the first five minutes, you basically see everybody's death. <laughs> yeah, I mean, what the fuck kind of, what were they thinking Yeah, spoiler that? alert, everybody. It's highlights, you know, it's like, it's like a trailer before the movie. Right, but it's like you see everybody's like, you know who's going to die and who's not, but yeah, whatever. Yeah. And you know, you know, when they were done shooting this scene on the final shot, yeah. Everybody was like, oh man, you were just so fucking magnificent. I got chills. That was fantastic. Now I perf that song that he sings, I performed live at the Skyline Drive. -in. Well, you didn't do that version. No. Shameless self See, which That was a good shot. Which is the other cool thing about this. So I am a sucker for like a, a self-referential theme song. 
like a Gilligan's Island type thing, something that tells you the story. There are three versions of Mad Men's thing. Three. And they're all kind of prequels. Yeah. The lyrics are kind of... He beat his uh, wife. What's the origin stories? Yeah. Brutally. Oh, shit. Right. Drink at the yeah. time. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Who else got that shit in the fucking head? Yeah. He once had a piece oh, of his nose. Beware the mad, mad boys. It was a night. Like tonight. And this dude does not seem like the kind of guy Many, who uh, would own and run like a, a gifted camp. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I think oh. It was, it, it was the same. Overrated as anonymous. Total fool. <laughs> the farmer. It was Twinkies that did me in. Went stark, raving, mad. There's not a damn Twinkie on this entire campus. He walked into his bedroom with an axe in his hand and chopped his sleeping wife into little pieces. Okay. Then this... with his bloodlust. Yeah, I've, when, I've wielded an axe. He walked Phones, down the hall. Uh, sure this you is get, where it just sounds like sure a Jewelers monologue, right? And he walked on down the hall. Yeah. <laughs> and he put a head. Not said mother. Except my interpretation of that song is that he doesn't kill his mother. Oh, no, that's not. Yeah. Or he does something else with her. Yeah, if you listen to the live versions, yes, he does. He says what Well, it wasn't long before the town found out what happened. Oh, it's just me. Yeah, it's, it's open for interpretation. Over for the mad farmer, or so they thought. It's a lot of murder and sex. Also, Touch Me jumped here was actually supposed to be Hit Me. To the nearest tree. Uh, but, you know, they said that was too violent. Wow, that, that was, So, yeah, they definitely That looks like a male thing. One of them grabbed a bloody what, axe. What were you about to say about the axe, though? I don't even fucking know what looks like. Okay. <laughs> That's the beauty of I was getting excited. Yeah. I think it was an angry scene with an axe. Something well, that, that was. When, when dude was like fucking, eh, 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 you know, struggling or whatever. It looked like, yeah, I, I've seen that on Pornhub somewhere. Somewhere. <laughs> you know, I, I'm just like flipping oh, through man. trying to get to granny porn and I'm just like, uh, no, I'm not into that. I mean, like, granny porn. You, you, you gotta go to the recommendation section. <laughs> no, no, man, their algorithm is way yeah. off of me, dude. <laughs> I mean, they, they suggest shit that's just fucking, I'm like, I don't think an algorithm exists for you, man. I'm like, oh, shit. <laughs> <that is it." laughs> yeah. yeah. German grandma porn, where's that? Yeah. yeah. Rabid Granny's the porno. Da! 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 I have Lloyd sign my copy of Rabid Granny's. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, let's not even talk about that. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, that was so good. Yeah, that was so good. Yeah, that was so good. Hey, the dubbing on that is it gone. It's terrible. Whoredom begets whoredom. That's all I'm saying. I'm very tempted to get another chicken wing. And if he hears you call get one. Man. Now, okay, what's this Richie dude? Okay, this the Richie kid, he's the oldest one. There are only six campers there. I guess the, the insinuation is that a lot of them have left. One one. Of course, we all know the real reason is they had no budget. Yeah. But uh, Richie's like way older than the other kids. He's like almost closer to the counselor's age. And he ain't bright. He is not a gifted child. What, so what the fuck he's doing well, I mean, they, here? They I think all that's get what murdered by the same dude. So uh, I would say that yeah, they're not the brightest. This ain't the fucking local Mensa. Well, no, no, no. I mean, at this point in time, it's just the end of camp. What's Mensa backwards? That's what this group is. Oh, gosh. No, it's just him. It's like the one kid, like actual kid That's camper. a great shot, though. You gotta admit, that home. Yeah. The one that they actually highlight is just a complete dipshit. It totally goes against what they're saying. The other kids are like fucking eight. <laughs> How far away was that house? Um, I always would like It was to about 12 miles it's in obviously, reality. <laughs> it's obviously a stone throw. Because... <laughs> I see what you... Oh, you yeah. witty bastard. Yeah. But I like how it's blue over there and it's black over here. Well, the campfire. Yeah. That's yeah. right. He's also going to try out with the New York Yankees next The time. house is lit by moonlight and, and they're lit by campfire. So Right. Yeah. Maybe, uh, but that's not really a good. It looks like Jack Nicholson's fucking adopted cousin or some shit. I don't know. Okay, I will say. You know what I'm that's Petroni and Nicholas. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise known as Johnny Paul. <laughs> yeah. Fucking forget about it. Don't ask no fucking questions. Yeah, that's right. He owns the sub shop up the fucking street. Tomorrow, his parents will be up to spend. 
Oh wow! Does he look like he's for Thanksgiving? He looks like he's wearing glasses without actually Winter wearing glasses. Yeah. Yep. You're right. Holy shit. No, I will say in all honesty that one of the things I find very okay. charming about this movie is that the people look the very normal. He really needs to drink water though. They just they're they're not yeah. they're not yeah. super attractive. A couple of them are downright homely. Yeah. You know, well, they didn't hire like hot people for this and it makes it makes it a little more charming because you actually kind of feel more fear for them because you're just like uh, that's, that's me. I, I identify with the ugly. <laughs> No, those two, the, two, the girl that looks like the Muppet and the dude with the bad porn stash, they're a couple, and they ain't the brightest either. I don't know how they're like, you know, helping these kids, but uh, they, uh, I, one day, I, it just hit me, I go, if they had a baby, it would be Freddie Mercury, my brain <laughs> I mean, I've reproduced, she's got, but like, I've this, never done this. She's got an overbite like and underbite, and <laughs> that Muppet hair. He's got that stash. Um, yeah, like that's the issue with fire films. Like no. with me, Same they're time. like all air apostle models in the Hollywood yeah. stuff. Uh -huh. and, that, yeah. and then they they always make them super obnoxious because they have this theory that like. Oh, we want the audience to hate them because remember in the 80s, you hate them and you wanted to watch them die? And I'm like, no, I don't remember that actually. No, I remember. I, I remember them not being obnoxious and I, and I liked them. I, if you look at Friday the 13th Part 2, for example, I liked all the teens in that. I liked them all. Yeah. Of them. There wasn't ones that I was like, oh, God, die. I, I mean, I wouldn't hang out. Yeah, I, I wouldn't wish that. Right, but you wouldn't wish But I wouldn't, I wouldn't hang out with them either. Uh, I would hang out with every single one of them. I would hang out with your like I mean, I mean, but you're, you're disqualified from discussion about part two. Really yeah, maybe part two is a bad point to make. Yeah, yeah, but they don't have one that they're purposely. I mean, maybe Scott, they're the pervy guy. Okay, they're let's not bring up part three because yeah, that kind of. Part three throws my theory a little bit. Oh, I like no, part three is... Oh, God, that's some Jim Jones kind of shit. Oh, yeah, he's... Some Utah shit going on up on the screen right now. Yeah, he's, he's got some... He's got a, a very odd look to him. He, he's a very odd guy. T.P. is a... Uh, he's a fucking close talker. You know... T.P. could be in a Martin Scorsese film, I think. He didn't say nothing. Like an early Martin Scorsese yeah. film. Yeah, had he not died an untimely death, but... Next to a uh, horse oh, head. Uh, no, I just mean no. I just mean in real life. He died pretty young. Oh, that sucks. I think he oh, died man, in his 40s, yeah. Sad. All right, Pete Tony Fish. Okay, that looks good. But, Keep you know, your name's Pete? TV. Wow. So what is it? Maybe like Tony Phillip or something, or Thomas Phillip or something? You know, he could really be changed to over to a Pixar character very easily. Double time in play. Go. See, TP makes makes me think of total packer. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Everybody else is singing toilet paper, but oh look, he must be very close to the house. He's blue. What the fuck? Well, now they're all blue. So. Yeah, I love that shot though of Madman Mars in the. That's. In the trees. Okay, but see, Richie's not a gifted child. Richie is. Yeah. Richie's the water boy. <laughs> <laughs> Richie's really good at math, but common sense just passed him by. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but you know what? There are a lot of people who are like that. Like they're academically like fucking ingenious, and then like, like when it comes to normal shit, math down like this. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> okay. So unrelated, uh -oh. unrelated story. What's going on now? So yeah, she's gonna relate apparently. <laughs> So every time I come in, now it's like, hey, Rebecca. And it's like, uh, you have math homework, don't you? Yeah. Like, I think, and I, when I say the, the, boys. the boys and yeah. him and my kid, all of them will come at me and be like, hey. Like, math homework, right? No. Well, I talk I'm to the to teacher you, and we're, try, we're trying to, like, practice stuff with him. I talk to the teacher. And so she said, do you want me to send more worksheets home for you to do? And I was like, yeah. Oh my god. Okay, so she sends home oh an, an entire, she sends for each of them 14 worksheets on Friday yeah. and tells them, well, Rebecca wanted me to send worksheets home with you. I'm, I'm the one that picks them up off the bus yeah. and they, they looked like fucking, they were walking into Treblinka and shit. I know, and then like Friday, the garage door opens and both of them are out there and like hugging me and I'm like, what's going on? We have a lot of homework. And I'm like... It's Friday, fuck it, whatever. Then I find the whole story that the teacher, the teacher threw me under the bus. Yeah. So now I'm the bitch who gets worksheets sent home. Fuck. 
fucking homework on the weekends. Who ever heard of that? You're like, I know Rebecca likes math. Me? <laughs> you know, I have. I still say my answer for the Indy squared problem is correct. Oh, what was that? I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's not very See, fucking helpful. You can, you can hang out with Richie at the gifted camp. <laughs> no, you know what? I'm with you on the... Uh, Richie's <laughs> he's curious. Yeah, he's curious. He's like, I'm yeah. 15. There's nobody here for me to bang. What else am I supposed to do at summer camp? Yeah. Jerk off. Uh, yeah, but he's in, the, he he's in this cabin with these like 10-year-olds and shit. That's what I don't care what age I was. I would be trying to get Galen Ross in the hot tub. You know. <laughs> that's right. I tried to beat TP to right, the punch. You you know? Yeah, but that's TP. That's yeah, you TP. don't want to fuck with TP's property. Oh, well, man. I tell you. Nah. Look at him. <laughs> no, I really do like God, I really want to quote Fast Times, but yeah. like fucking I can't. Now I got the music in my head. Come on in. Wow. Well, that's not... I really like her. I like Stacy. The There's worst thing she can have. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I like, yeah, I like, I like her. She's I think she looks Italian-American for sure. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. I think they were going for Three's Company. On Indiana the girl here is the only one who doesn't look like she could be in the mob. Am I wrong? <laughs> Don't get me started on Three's Company. <laughs> That's right. Because he's... <laughs> His holy shit man character's got a whole theory on that shit. <laughs> Jack Tripper. She's no Jack Christine the Ripper. Ripper. Yeah. T Ripper. Don Z still quotes the bad whole <laughs> Jack the Ripper. Knife. Why does she have a knife on her fucking belt? Well, because she's a she's a camp counselor, but this is supposed to be for gifted children, not for like kids who are actually going to like camp camp. So yeah, it doesn't make sense. All right, well explain the fucking. Well, I think she's the Braveheart. Bird. I think she just got a uh, can of. Chicken. They and then the, so that's why damn it, Janet. <laughs> I'm just a sweet transvestite. And, and Galen Ross, God bless her, but she's got freakishly big eyes. She's a, she's got an odd look to her, yes. And the lighting in this does not do any of the kids' no, favors. not at all. It's way too blown the fuck out, man. Yeah. I'm really looking forward to them dying now. Nah, Stacy's Stacy's an awesome friend. No, Stacy's sure. Stacy's the kind of girl I would hang out with, and she even says I don't have a whole lot of women friends. Like she's just a little more like no nonsense. You know, I hear her mom's got it going on. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> Well times, my friend. Well times. Where's the four loco? <laughs> of course you're drinking a fucking four loco. Come on. Like so my, I bought some strawberry and You don't have any drywall, man. <laughs> like my, my, my liver over here is like, no! Call on 911 and shit. Now we got some strawberry and cream uh, moonshine. Yeah. Mm. Because it, yeah. It might be frozen by now. Because every time oh, I've no. seen this at the liquor store, I'm like, this is something that Brent would buy. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's also the same, impossible. the same people who make the pickles. Yeah. The moonshine pickles, which I almost got, uh, but that yeah. would have been selfish for me. There was a, there was a bit of okay. a dilemma. Was yeah, crazy the, the they're is. good, but the thing is, like, I was it's only like moonshine cherries today at work. Oh. There was a bit of a dilemma. We were leaving with like a store we got our shit. All right, well. And then she stopped and was like frozen, <laughs> staring at the fucking moonshine. Yeah. And I'm like, Brent, this, this to me, I see this pink bottle, and I'm like, and I'm like, no, I'm buying this for Brent. I'm like, I'm like, this, this is strawberry shortcake puree. Oh no, I, it just, I don't know why, it just, do the, do the honors. Yeah, like if you get that pickle moonshine, it's just like, I mean, there's. It's 14%. Oh, it does smell Really? It's not oh, wow. It does. I think we need to get shot glasses or something. We don't have shot glasses, and it's moonshine. We're drinking it's out moonshine. of this. It's moonshine. You're supposed to... Wow. Are you next? Yes, I'm right. <laughs> okay. I, I feel like I'm in the drive through at fucking Mickey D's. It smells delightful. Yeah, that just smells like... Shit. Oh, it's a whole... It smells, <laughs> like, oh. Oh. Right. It smells like strawberry right. quick. We need a nice yeah, strawberry. Yeah, I know. Uh, here, oh. here, Rob, go get some. Okay. Yeah, what? Shot here. glasses? No. No, we don't have shot glasses, but we have little bowls. I'm drinking it. <laughs> I'm drinking it right out of the thing. I'm drinking it I out know, of the thing. I know, that's what I'm thinking. It's a mason jar. Let's just drink it out of it. Out of it. Out of it. it. Because it's, that's what moonshiners do. That's, that's the one. That's why it's, yeah, that's why it's not an individual mm. thing. 
Ooh. Ooh. Wow. Wow. Homeboy yeah. got fucked up. And it's got that Crayola blood, you know. Mm. <laughs> And then you say Ziggy Zaggy, Ziggy Zaggy. Oi, 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 oi. Don't see Richie anywhere. He must have stayed back at the campfire. That's pretty good. What do? Make up his bed like he's sleeping. Got to keep him I'll have to cut it with some day. Me, but Richie knows what he's doing. It's, it's, hmm. it's no, easy really strawberry delightful. milk. It is wow. very delightful. I feel, oh, this could be really yeah, bad, that, you guys. I feel like a sinner. That doesn't even taste... Anything? I mean, that just tastes like. Uh, oh, wow! It tastes like like. <laughs> I feel like a sinner. Oh shit! I okay, think I I'm jerked off in front of the yeah. Lord. It doesn't this taste is, like Pepto. No, this it is the kind know. of thing that like right now seems great, and then but we only have two bathrooms, and you know, so somebody's gonna have to puke outside later because that's where this is going. I <laughs> oh, think. I thought you were talking it about. It tastes pee. better like, the second dude, time coming up. Three out of four of us mm -hmm. have penises, and we have the outside. So. Oh no. Brown. I prefer to puke outside. Anyway. I pay the mortgage, yeah. so I am I get a bathroom if we're puking up the strawberry shit. Yeah. Would you guys like another drink of it? We're almost like halfway oh. done. <laughs> oh, man. Well, I mean, yeah, honestly, was... like, look at the well, percentage. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I bet you it's pretty low. Percentage. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, it might be the same as the four loco. It mm -hmm. might be. But it's like, it's like a 12% It's white alcohol. chocolate strawberry cream. Yeah, 12% man. I bet you it's probably about 12% or something like that. Maybe 15 uh, you can get a 15 cents in Vermont. Yeah, you can't hear. Can't turn it down. That was the best when I lived in Detroit. I would turn my cans, man. Oh, yeah. Bank. 35 proof. Oh. 35 proof? Uh oh. 17.5%. Seven, uh -oh. That's about what JB's at, probably. Uh oh. Really? Yeah, it's probably a little bit higher, but somewhere around there. 40%. 40 <laughs> Charles. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, so. My son's <laughs> running away. Oh wow, Zach Galligan. You don't feed him after midnight, yo. You know, I could have brought yeah. it, but I have straight men trying at home. I don't know. That either. sounds like a really bad idea. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, well, you know, you just take a little bit. Let, let's run right, the experimental I'm with the. I'm being, I'm being the responsible one and I'm putting the lid back on. Five more drunken commentaries from now, though, we'll be ready for the I yeah. real Hi, my name's Rob. I'm next an alcoholic. One, <laughs> next one, Moonshine. We'll have a still so. right here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they'll never go out in the woods alone. Ever again. We got a cornfield right there, too, so. <laughs> yeah, look, those two, I mean, seriously. Wow. There's, there's, a, there's just so many, so much you know 80s shit in this. Yeah. Stories around the fire, and I don't want to ruin it, but I'm concerned with the effect it has on the younger ones. Where the quasi pretty fucking quasi smart it. chick, good point. fucking big rapist. I don't have any objections to. Oh yeah. Let's see. Grandpa pedophile. Next year I'll get a hundred. Don't get into it. I like to keep my stuff. And there's damn it, Janet. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and then uh, it's it's really refreshing seeing Galen Ross not play a total bitch. Wow, he's here. Yeah. Oh my god, that's fucking Donald wow. Trump. That's Trump, oh, yo. No, that's not. He's got way more hair than Donald Trump ever had. Yeah, like back in the day, though. I'm getting a bit too old for this kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna go take my Viagra and fuck my. No, no, no. <laughs> he's going into town to go play cards. Oh. Yeah. That's what they call it. Keep a sharp eye on the kid. If your boner lasts more than four hours, <laughs> grab more pillows. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was call your buddies and brag about it. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I, put, I keep my phone on fucking silent, bro. <laughs> I had a boner my whole high school Jesus career. Yeah. Yeah, you know. Yeah. I like to publicly apologize to Bessie and for the rest of you. Yeah. Jesus, is that Jerry Seinfeld handle? <laughs> I mean, you know what I mean? He almost That's like, it. like what's with the hair? It almost seems like he's had a stroke or something. Like he talks about yeah, it. Yeah, that's yes, good. Yes, the a good blanket that Brent right gave there. me. That Brent came over in the middle of the night one night. Me and Chuck were totally <laughs> drunk, and he brought me a Friday the Thirteenth NES blanket. <laughs> May you always have more than you need. That was a good night. It was a good night. Yeah. I was being a whole Okay, okay, oh, okay, whoa, 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 okay, whoa, whoa. now. Whoa, everybody just uh, stop uh -oh. what the fuck you're uh -oh. doing and you watch this. Ooh.
And yes, this is it's Wacky on. singing. This is this is my favorite song in any slasher. Lots of doubt. lots of bones. Wing, how many wing. how many words can rhyme with TV? We told you. We told you. I tried to warn y'all. He, he's got like a semi Audi. Like it's not quite an Audi, but it's somewhere there. But it takes like super pride to put your initials when they're TV, especially on your fucking. And we're gonna see. We're, we're gonna see why TP gets his name. Yeah. Shit himself. Oh. She got some nice I do dig the hot tub, but this this song is just. This oh. this scene literally gives. I like. I want drama. Me. Here we go, this. boys. This little, isn't the TV edit. A little bit of booty Woo! for the ladies. <laughs> That's right. Uh, you don't fucking What the fuck? God. It, it just sounds like fuck. Oh, what's his name? I always sing, uh, if you want to know how much my penis can grow. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> now, we, we've all been in hot tubs. Have you ever had it's this a, desire to a, spin around the hot tub? But not just spin around the hot tub, but also spin around as you spin yeah, around. Spinning the hot tub. Yeah. Yes, like this playful oh. cat and mouse. It was not, no. Well, TP's no. sticking his dick in the jets. I think Joe Giannoni, <laughs> oh, I think, yeah. had some, uh, he yeah. needed to learn some directing skills here. I don't know. No, I would, uh, um, hmm. Like, does this not make you just fucking dizzy? <laughs> it, just, it just sounds like fucking, I've seen fire and I've seen rain, but on, like, fucking heroin. No, no. Yeah, it's kind of like a... Jackson Brown a little bit. You're saying? I would hate to be the guy that has to clean out the uh, hairs in that tub. Because yes. oh. is, he is a hairy son of a bitch. Oh, oh no, no, no. The filter cleaner? <laughs> I wonder if that's going to be a fucking credit. Look at that hair. <laughs> This is where Becca's like, oh no, that's nothing. You should have seen the filter after Brent was in the hot tub. No, no not you. Oh, I, I got I got video of that shit. <laughs> yeah. I got multiple videos. Okay, yeah. That was funny as shit. Go go buy holy shit, man. Um, that was that was funny. No, 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 no. Everybody be, be quiet here and I I wanna just get your guys' actual reaction to this next part. I just because I've seen this a uh, uh, hundred times and I still don't understand. Looks like it's gonna be hot tonight, or it's raining outside. Looks like a hot. Warm. It looks like a sauna, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I don't know. The, okay. The baby. Just thing. hang on. <laughs> I was right in the middle. You didn't let me. <laughs> so. What? So was he going down under under water? But they were both down. No, wait, 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 wait. I got it. I think they were trying to figure out underwater sixty nine. And they just, they just fucked it all up. Right. And they, oh, 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 oh. I'm sorry, but I've never been like, oh god, I was right in the middle of an orgasm, and ha ha ha, so funny. Like, yeah. yeah. No, stay down there a couple seconds longer. What the yeah. fuck? <laughs> no more, dude. No you more. didn't let me finish, but I don't understand. Like, what the fuck are they doing underwater? I don't understand. Well, if you're going to take like three minutes to come, you can't stand it. Right. Uh -huh. and, but maybe that's his thing. Maybe he's like, I can you as you hold my breath. Oh, yeah, baby. What, what if it's a mutual jet thing? Mm -hmm. yeah. What if, like, they... Oh, Jesus. What if they splayed their assholes together on the jet and was like... Oh. Right. Yeah. <laughs> right. Exactly. So that's what happens during hot tub for him. I'm saying. Yeah. Sadly, we don't have a hot tub. <laughs> nah. We'll get one. We'll get one. Oh, I forgot. Yeah. I know. You, yeah, you brought up a painful thing. So yeah, it's... there are holes in it. Uh, Becca's all right, dude. Don't kill me. Where am I? Nah, we're, we're, we'll get another one. You're in Terabithia. <laughs> yeah. I think, you I think you realize that it's beneficial to you to just get a real hot tub. I mean, you use it a lot. Oh, yeah. I'd love to have a real hot tub. But you know what? We can't even, like, make a cup of coffee and run the microwave at the same time without blowing a breaker. So I don't think all the tub yeah. is gonna work in the electricity here. Yeah, this, yeah you just steal run, from your neighbors. You yes. gotta run like an ancillary. Yeah, yeah, like yeah, like even the kids know. Like I'll yeah. be making coffee in the morning. They'll come in to like make something. Yeah. And they'll just kind of stand there, and I'm like, I "What are you doing?" The electrician. Well, calls, I want. 
I want a, I want a sandwich, but yeah, I know you're making coffee. I have when, to you, wait. when you flush, when you flush the toilet, you gotta shake your left leg and fucking pray to the god, fucking Freya. Do you guys use the K cup thing or? Yeah. No? I do. You like regular coffee or? I like yeah, just, I mean coffee, but like with the flavor. Like I, there's one. It's Ooh, is that caramel, the sweet transvestite? Caramel truffle <laughs> private yeah. selection from transsexual Transylvania. Oh, okay, they're K cups. Uh, yeah. uh, All right. I didn't like it. I'm more of a girly coffee kind of How'd you do? Oh, so maybe that's why I... That's why when I saw this, I thought of you. Okay, this is why we don't do four-person drug and commentary. We're having like two separate yeah, conversations. We're talking about Rocky Horror Picture Show. And nobody that's cares Rocky about Horror, yo. Stacey. Nobody's oh, Stacey. That's exactly what we were talking about. Just like Dr. Frankenfurt. She looked like Frankenfurt going oh, God, up. We, we going up it. the hill going, I'm just a sweet <laughs> transvestite. Yeah, but you know what? In all, in all of our not paying attention, we didn't pay attention to her that's you. playing the flute. Dude, that's on you. Oh, there's porn stash. There's no beauty in this. Ooh, what yep, the that's fuck? what I'm telling you. Oh, I've done this actually. We did this on the Obamas and then you yelled at us. No, I yelled at Heather. <laughs> I, the, I don't know who Holy else. Holy shit, we've done this, <laughs> dog. It's like that 70s show. Not me, show I had to do sounds. So I was like always. No, 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 at night. I never got we in trouble. Were... Oh, well, well, then I'd go right to the RV. Yeah. Right, we, we slept in the <laughs> sneaky RV, right? Oh, God. Sam I didn't hang never... out party, except a couple nights, I guess. Yeah, like when we watched Island of Death. If we were watching a movie, I'll hang out with you. Oh, God, what a fuck. Oh, dude, that's just... That was... So ooh, that was, that was like a Charlie's Angels sort of pose for them. You never know if I'm thinking Now, this guy... I don't even know what this guy's name is. He's like the most throwaway character. He looks like Bruce. It seems to I feel like they wanted to make him the red herring, but it, the story is so flimsy that... But you and, see, and so I mean, is the sweater. You, you see mm -hmm. Mad Man all the way throughout the... I know, but like, hey, like working it, but, but, but maybe he's Mad Man's nephew or something. I don't know, he yeah, seems yeah. like he's cracking. Cool. Like Mad Man cracked or whatever. I'm my emotions. Okay, okay, this is me after seeing it a million times. No, going, I've never... I think they kind of wanted it to be. Okay, that's really interesting, yeah. See how that's easy cool. it is to Again, it's the hands. And who where you know? I've, okay, 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 I did it. I'm not. I just don't. You did it, didn't you? The button-up shirt, the sweater, or what? Oh, I still do that. Look. I'm sure I had to. I did it. Yeah, that's my office look. She's got a. She's got the booty fro. Yeah. I did a sweater vest. I mean, who ever thought of like a button-up shirt and then like let's press the buttons up against your body as close yeah. as we can? That sounds like a great oh. idea. Oh, I love it. You got to get her into my picture. I missed the silk shirts. Ooh, the color block ones. The kid and play. Oh, yeah. We get one overall strap down. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You know, I recently acquired. Oh, this motherfucker is still alive. I recently acquired a Dylan McKay doll, by the way. I already had Kelly and Brenda, but now I have Dylan, too. This dude's still alive. It, it, doesn't he have an apple pie to fuck somewhere? And again, did, I love that movie. <laughs> oh, my God. Not, not, not judging, I'm just saying. You know, it's One a time reference. and band camp. Yeah. So, I mean, oh, back in the magical time. I even like band camp, the American Fire <laughs> Band Camp. Eh. Can you tell me anything about where Richie the Wise Guy is? Yeah, yeah, let's... Why are you ripping my fucking... Yeah. What the fuck? That dude is... No, back in the magical... Jacket? The magic flashlight. flashlight. Why the Nobody fuck? Leaves the That's of all places to put a flashlight. Right, your, your, yeah, breast pocket, no. I would have put it in my belt buckle. I, yeah. I walked I don't know, maybe, maybe he gave something. that to her. I had that blanket, I had that blanket. It's still uh, in the steam room. I did, I had that blanket. It's gone, it was my baby one. Oh. That, that fucker is disintegrating. <laughs> <laughs> and why don't you get I'm old. I'm old. I'm old. I'm still got my Jimmy Hendrix experience. Good dog out there. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. But it's like, totally like pop scene. Hold up like a motherfucker. It's awesome. It's like a crop top with your pants on. Yeah. That's how Jimmy Hendrix would move. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
That's for holy like, shit, ma'am. He's it's, gonna wear it's that. Like, <laughs> I saw my Martinsville cheerleader satin jacket yeah. with my name on it. Awesome. Nice. Really? Nothing, it's okay. Aww. Be careful. I'd love to see that. Somehow we need to get the Madman poster. We, to we do need to get the Madman poster because it's it's glorious. Uh, Grab it. I gave it to Rebecca as a sort of. Well, she, she deserved it more than I did. Yeah, like sometimes you get something and you're like, this is cool, but like, you're like, but there's somebody else who really needs it. And I did the same thing. Yeah, this blanket. Brandon gave me this blanket for that reason. And I felt the same way for a Raider Squad poster that I bequeathed. She thinks. It's a charm. <laughs> So when you, I, think, I, 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 so when you think of Charlie, that. think of Rake Squad. So <laughs> I didn't read into that at all. <laughs> okay, wait, okay. There's it's fucking Lionel Richie's cousin. Dude, the, the, we're the, lucky uh, this movie even exists on right. HD format, though. Yes. I have a better idea. Oh, no, no, no. no all no, night no, long. No, no. no. no, no. He could, I like always it. said he could have been the, uh, if, if the head counselor didn't show up the day, they could have had that guy. Yeah. You know that guy with the nut hug? Well, they are all Yeah, they're, they're they're everybody's wearing nut huggers, but yes. Same Ronnie. Shit. Yeah. Yeah. No, uh, actually, the, the fact that this there's H, the next she thing. Jacket. So the reason why I even knew this movie existed is back, way back when, about an HGTV before there was any HD okay. program. And there was a satellite company called Boom. Okay. They had 12 channels, and they played like the same shit over and over. There was hardly any content. So there just wasn't a lot of HD, but there was one channel called okay. Monsters HD that fucking I adored. Mm -hmm. But it was like it was like HBO or MTV yeah. in the early days where it was we like they, they didn't have that many fucking things. Yeah. So uh, this was one of the the movies, and like you know, when I was uh, Monsters Inc. Not Monsters, uh, Monsters uh, HD. Come on, Ricky. Come on out. I know you're in there, Richie. <laughs> but like they had like the oh, Blind yeah, Dead right. movies. They had this. They had a couple of the Friday the Thirteenth, whatever. But like. Yeah. Like when my kid was like three or four, she'd be in her room and like, she'd, like Madman would come on in here and like she'd run in and be like, "Are you watching Madman Mars?" You know, like so it was one of the first HD movies that I ever saw. Actually, I mean, I don't yeah. think the transfer is gonna get any better because they still have those weird like the little lines in the middle of a lot of the scenes. Dollars of donuts. If yeah, this dude's still alive. He's old as fuck. No, he's dead. He's the one I said he died kind of young, 40s, 50s. Uh, I would Google it, but my phone is over there, and I, I try to keep depression out of Duncan commentary, but, well, you know. You know. But we have him immortalized know. with yeah. that belt buckle. Well, she is. Yeah. Becca. That's right, TP. Yeehaw. TP and your butt chin. A shot. And a shot. Total pervert, yeah. Mm -hmm. this, mm -hmm. is, this is going to be one of her last times to... Uh, yeah. As you saw earlier. <laughs> yeah, right. As you saw in the opening, he hang dies. Him, hang him high. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, filmography's limited. Love swing. Yeah. When that, they showed the rope, that was a little bit of a poor. Yeah. That and then was they, beyond they show, foreshadowing. They show Stacy being dragged <laughs> away. Like, you're pretty much like, you. Yeah, she's dead. Yeah. Like, I thought the thing off. Now, I will say that I like, like, as far as hangings go and stuff, I love this one. Like, oh, yeah. because there's a lot of, uh, dare I say realism, because I know what it's like to be, you know. No, he just, he does the right thing. Like, okay, right then he, you know, he's addled, so, yeah, it would have been nice if he would have just taken it off his neck right then. Wow, that's, but, that's like a, some horse. You have a good pulley system there, too. Yeah. yeah. Right. They, they have that shit hooked up. All right, but everybody does this, right? But yeah, that's what you're supposed to do is grab the rope and try to pull up to get the tension off because you're not going to get anything from pulling on the yeah. rope. But yeah, but you slip. But no, the, you're the, trying to do that and you slip here. The, the longer the uh, the noose, mm -hmm. yeah. the more knots. Mm -hmm. That's totally supposed to break your fucking neck. Right that should have been. Oh yeah. really? Like cause it's the way it's tied around. Right. Well, and then the fewer. <laughs> knots. Okay, we. I, I'm, I'm just no. I'm stopping everybody right now. I'm. I'm stopping everybody right now. Brent, say your line again. Huh? Okay. I totally reject it all. Right now. <laughs>
Yeah. In your last know. moment? But this is the worst though. It's the worst that he oh. kills her with the table boat. Oh. Because he gets up there. I mean, he actually. The irony. Wow. His eyeballs are bugging like a motherfucker. That was really good. I really wish they would have put shoes on Madman because. Uh, <laughs> What's he wearing? <laughs> Fucking electrical tape? Madman no, might be got... Bigfoot. We don't know. <laughs> yeah. They're... Oh, that's his toes? <laughs> and Holy his hand... shit. Did you see his hands earlier? They were kind of yeah. like... Yeah. They were like Krampus and shit. Yeah. I feel wow. as if... And that was a Toxic Avenger noise. See? He bit his tongue, too. Mm-hmm. Um... Ah, oh, poor guy. He loves me not. I'd be like, bitch, you got tits like that, and you're playing that game? Come on. He loves me not. And you're doing it with a construction paper flower? She's talking about Flyboy from now and then. Hmm. Or Ted Danson. Are you? From Creepshow. Yeah. People often forget that she's she's the Becky who is at least buried in the sand. Nice yeah. That's one of the best happens, skits, too. Oh, that's one of my favorites. Last year it took us about Leslie Nielsen, yes. Yeah. He made a left instead of a right and wound up in the North Fork. Yeah, that's... <laughs> Betsy, I'm surprised at you. I didn't know you were such a warrior. She's got cheekbones like, uh... I don't know. Maybe it's like Betsy Ross. Yeah. 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 Ye
back of her flashlights that big in the 80s? Like, yes, you had to put like 4D batteries in them. They had to be yeah. big enough for that. Yeah. That was some do the right thing shit. 20D batteries, motherfucker. Yeah, 4D batteries and they lasted an hour tops. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what about that? But then you take it, take the batteries out and you can put baked beans in it and give it to your native friend when you go to the yeah. Grand Canyon and your body and Sydney Creek. But you also could always do like that and get about another half hour. Oh, yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just At like, least you know, smart flicking, enough, yeah. you know, the yeah. phone, when you flick it, oh. it, it always works. That, yeah. that never worked in the history of the fucking world. Works. Never. Flick it, flick it, it always turns. So you kind of shake right. weight in the light. Yeah, flick it, flick yeah. It. Hey, yeah. Those flick. are words to live by, guys. Flick Things the aren't working, just flick the button. And it, yep. Yeah. Hey, shake weight it. Shake weight it. <laughs> <laughs> For the ladies, shake weight it. <laughs> <laughs> or for the guys, you know, whatever. Or just get in the hot tub and Get one of those jets up your asshole. Or get a bidet. We also had that conversation. That seems a little bit more practical. I don't know, dude. I don't know. A, a bidet is a little more precise, I think. Right? Yeah. Uh, it, it, it feels more yeah. Japanese about it. It's more yeah. European. It's kind of, yeah, it's a yeah. European kind of thing. But, but if you're a fella, you've got a couple of lady friends, you know, you might want to try out a man. I am going I am going to find a hotel that has a bidet. Because and I'm gonna re I'm gonna record you're gonna, you. Oh, I'm gonna no. record you using it. And don't use it. Don't have your first bidet oh, no, in a hotel. Just don't fly Virgin Air. Oh, do they have bidets in there? there Virgin go. Air. There that's there like the super well, hoity. First class. They're super hoity twitty because they've got like the beds yeah. and shit. Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Fuck. Yeah. What's that dude's name? Super the Virgin Air guy. Yeah. Yeah. guy who just has way too much money. Richard Branson. Yeah. Richard Branson. 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 Man, Jeff Bezos has kind of like uh, overshadowed him lately. Yeah. There for a while, he was the filthy rich dude that everybody wanted to hate. Yeah, they got a little peck of competition going on. Yeah. yeah. Who gets in while you're shutting her to space first? <laughs> yeah. You know, if I had billions, I'd What is this guy's who name? Could... I seriously, I do not. It's probably like Chris or something. I think it's Paul or. Yeah, it's probably like Paul. I forgot it was so written by. Way. It was written by an Italian, so it's either Paul or Paulie. Yeah, or uh, I don't know. There's a there's a couple of names. It's there. written by an Italian, but then they hired they hired a little blonde girl from Indianapolis to be their lead. See, that's why I bought with their Shiba, their Shiba Bitcoin. Oh man, Shiba Bitcoin. Shiba isn't that that girl? In the... Oh my god. Yeah. I was All thinking right, Sheetar from Blood Diner, but yeah. I don't that's know. a good shot. Yeah, that's shot. what I was about to say, Blood Diner. I've already made $200 from Bitcoin, so. Woo! And you you spend more than that. You spend more than that on. Like, Let's buy some Coke and fucking vote for Ronald Reagan. <laughs> that's right, buddy. Ooh, is that Cher? Oh, no, it's that. I think. I used to wear my hair. Cher like now that. or 78? Uh, They're pretty much one and the same. That's oh, true. That is, I'm saying. You know, that is so true. Shit, shit. Exactly. Right. Well, Betsy, that's the difference between you and me. Like her boobs You're content look to sit behind really good unlocked. without the shirt. I'd like to know what's going on. I'll see you in a little while. But with that shirt or that she, bra, I don't, I don't know. Bras have. She's kind of. She's got this like pitiful look on her face the whole time, yeah. and that just that fucking bright light. Yeah. Oh, here, here we go. This is where I, I came to the realization that the two of them could have a baby and it'd be Freddie Mercury. Yeah. There's just one particular shot. First of all, we do not need to see them fucking. It's right here, right here. <laughs> I think a double negative oh, makes you know double negative makes a positive. Though. Oh yeah, the, it might be like the fucking. Yeah, but there's three. Hot... <laughs> wow, yeah, that, there's she's... just entirely too much afro on this fucking scene. You know, if you really got your head in the tent with people fucking that long, you want yeah. part of it. Or, you know what I'm saying? Right, like you don't want to be smelling that shit if you're not part of it. I don't know for sure. There's like, yeah, yeah. Okay. ew. Y'all smell like y'all fucking. Right, fucked right. Yeah. Smellovision TV. Can we all smell it right now? It's a smell of production. Definitely. <laughs> be right there. We're coming. They want her to join too. Did I, they you see that do. smile? Okay. Yeah, right? Fucking yeah. Lego. Are you alright? It is not a Lego. It was, it was oh. oh, it was the. Yeah, Charlie. 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 Oh, oh, wait, here we go. Leaving his sick all over. That's the place. my bad. What's up, Blue? What's up, my guys? You wanna hang out? Watch the show? I'm sick again for no reason. 
Oh, sick again. Like what sneezy? Sneezy. Huh? Stuffy-ish. Stuffy. Stuffy. Medicine. You, here. You need to eat more pizza. Come That's here. Come here, Gabe. The fix is. This is Gabe. AKA boyfriend. AKA Blue. What's up, Blue? Blue, you're my boy! You're my boy. Blue, you're my boy! You got me! Ah, uh, man. I just recently made him watch that movie. Yeah. You'll see me. Let's go streaky! Yeah. <laughs> You'll see me anywhere on the internet. You can't escape me. See, I actually followed you on your YouTube. So, oh. I'm one of your subscribers. Oh boy. That's right, he's a YouTuber, man. Mm -hmm. I actually need to make some more content and actually do stuff on my YouTube. Yeah, so do I. That's why I have friends over and we're drinking and watching a movie. Or, well, we're passively. drinking the cool, refreshing taste of a four local! <laughs> yeah, four local will make you shake your pants. Wait. You know, that is clearly the work. Dude, he had this, he had this shit called juice. You don't say it. You don't say it. What? That is clearly the work of. Holy oh, shit, babe. <laughs> no, he had something called Juice. It was like J-O-O-S or something. Yeah. And like, after two of them, like, Rob's like, give me the juice. Give me the juice, Brent. Oh, <laughs> he was you need to get some Mad Dog 2020. Oh, oh fuck. And then, you yeah. know, Great next juice. time we do a commentary, juice, I will have to go nostalgic and get the MD 2020. Yeah, oh. get, yeah get MD 2020, oh, no, 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 get no. the loco. You know something good as far, Mark, yeah. No, I'm gonna say if you can find some kind of, uh, you know, on eBay, like a vintage bottle of uh, fucking purple passion. Oh my god, I got so fucked up. At oh my god, that's see, that's what this stuff is like. Like I can't tell you how many times as a teenager that was coming out of my nose because it was like grape soda. Yeah. But it was like malt liquor, and yeah. like <laughs> you know, like you're just drinking it, going. Woo, this Kool-Aid's yeah. awesome! And then like like later somebody's like holding your hair back and you're just like When I was a junior in high school, I brought a two liter of purple passion to auto mechanics class. And the fact and the fact yeah, that no it came did. in two liters. It was alcohol that came in two liters. Yeah. How beautiful is that? Yeah. So, we you know what we had a magical childhood. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like it. I had something similar, uh, bullfrog, Kentucky bullfrog. Yeah. Never heard of that, but I don't, I, I guarantee it was not purple passion. It has to do what we're doing. We got it for the lost kids. Oh, wow, See, it bugs me if they still have, have like, you know. It's always during his scenes, too. The more people you have, know, me and my friend Karen drank a two liter between. I'm going to catch up with Stacy. My stomach is churning, but I'm also it's smiling as you're yeah. telling me the story. Wow, that was true. Oh, that, yeah. Boone's Farm, oh, wow. you mentioned that, too. Strawberry Hill. Strawberry! <laughs> How do I feel like a shit people whenever I say strawberry? Strawberry Hill, I'll buy them my thrill. Oh, Boone's Farm, Strawberry, strawberry Hill. Hill. <laughs> oh my god, Diane and I, like, we would get that. We would just, like, we'd sit there like white trash mamas and just, like, each of us have a bottle of that fucking Strawberry Hill and just be swigging it. <laughs> yup. <laughs> Yep. If, you, if you didn't do that, if you didn't do that as a teenager or a young adult, yeah, I feel sorry for you. Did you notice they put a piece of tape across the? It was like Timex or whatever the name of the fucking clock was. Want to sit and watch? Oh, you mean like the <clears throat> like thing? So Dave. Well, here, but you gotta sit down, man. Sit. You gotta sit down. We're recording. Yep. Richie. Dave. Dave. That's his name. No, wait, no. Dave is the other guy. Dave is the Muppet guy. Dave, who, man? Dave's not Dave's here. Dave's not here. <laughs> Alex, do you want to come? You want to go lay down? My sickie. Here, yeah, wait, they're going to say it right. Yeah. Dave's not here, man. You, got, you guys will see me all over the end. Um, can, Charlie, can you plug back in the thing that's next to their, their PlayStation 4 plug for now? It's an extension cord with an adapter because... Don't ask questions. Right. Again, can't make coffee and... I don't know that I see it. Ah, here, I'll get it. Well, actually, it's kind of... Here, you really need to scoot the couch. Scoot the couch. Hey, guys, this is what you get when you get it. You gotta scoot the couch. All right, all right, scoot the couch, scoot the couch. Save the moonshine. Richie! Okay. I should do it now. <laughs> Right. Oh, Richie, what the fuck, Richie? Yeah, 
That's oh, the whole thing. All, all of this is because Richie decided to throw a rock in the magic of our window. Yeah, what a bitch. Oh, uh, Rabble, lots of shit going on. Moving past, moving past. The prongs Where were uh, a little bent, so to say. Alright, yeah. test it out. Alright. Cool. Oh, the alarm clock fell. Uh, I thought I heard something. Yeah, it's all good. Well, watch your feet. Hey. Yeah, oh. Charlie likes to leave yeah, like, on the floor. I like the way you did it. Well, like, I, I forgot that that's one other area. You're, 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 oh no! I was told to set my alarm clock on fire this weekend because of the yeah. ceiling stuff. Oh wow. But I'm like, you know, in the winter I can understand, the spring I kind of want to set my alarm clock on fire. Uh, just in general. Yeah. Uh, not a fan of alarm clocks. But for my job in the winter time. Oh wow. Uh, they change. What they the change. Fuck? They change the hours I work to an hour later in daylight savings time. So it's like I'm actually coming into work two hours later than I have normally been. <laughs> that's a bad thing? But it, well, that's a good thing. But right. then in the spring, they said it's spring forward. Right. And then they change the hours to, in the, uh, to change time while I'm coming in two hours Indiana, earlier. Indiana didn't do it for fucking ever. Fucking Indiana. I fucking hate dialect savings. Fucking wax on, wax off. Pull my finger. There's no reason to you change won't. your clock. It's just straight okay. up communism. Okay. Communism. No, here's the thing. Yeah, it's communism, goddamn. Fucking communism. No, I, the best description oh. I ever saw was it's like. It's like white people decided. Fucking communist man. No, if white people decided to cut two inches off the bottom of their blanket and sew it to the top. That's daylight savings time. Yeah. We got a longer blanket. Yeah. Yeah. And beer. Bleach. Old sarsaparilla. Oh, good. Sarsaparilla. Yeah. It's sarsaparilla. Is that well done? Yeah. Where do I get sarsaparilla? In Smurf Village, obviously. <laughs> Fucking dark now, I'll tell you what. The Noble Romans on 135, they have a, um, a rear tap. Uh-huh. Like a keg, yeah. You know how she dies. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. 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 that the car is yellow and her jacket yeah. is I know, I was, and her, uh, her flashlight has a yellow top to it, too. Yeah. I love that, yeah, she's so yeah. color coordinated. It's All the kills good. are symbolic, it's like a Fellini film. Yeah, okay, wait, hold on. Just want to say it. Charlie says, Madman, it's like a Fellini film. Just yeah. throw it out there. But no, it is, there is like a thing. She's the sunshine. She's the bright spot. Yeah. yeah in the Air Force, I had like a small yellow cone on my flashlight. Yeah. It was like that long. I know. It's kind of crazy. That we His had hands don't look quite so big in that shot. You know, I'm okay with... She I, I have, uh, she's... Dude, have you never had a car that had to have that? Uh, had a carburetor. Um, oh, yeah, that you yeah, hit with a fucking hammer. <laughs> yeah. oh, have no, you ever had no, that no. happen to you? No, I had a car like that. Like, I haven't the had little, my head cut off. On a carburetor, the little butterfly trap would get stuck. So I'd have to put a screwdriver in it, start the car, get back out, and take the screwdriver out. I, I totally, I understand, because that was my life for a while. Yeah, that's that shit from the fucking show we watched last night. Are you ready? And that's Daryl Hall. Or John Ross. That's whichever one. Yeah. Which one are you, dude? I don't know which one he is. And again, he's one of them. Again, she. They both seem very sweet, but do they seem like they should be guiding the gifted children of the world? No. Like, don't you think gifted children campers or counselors should be gifted and somewhat themselves? And these two are just. They seem like they should be leading a prayer service over a fucking bologna and cheese sandwich. No, but they're but they're the ones we see naked. I mean, if you think about it, like, I mean, you know, you've got, you've obviously got. We, we saw a blonde. Right, we saw that. But, like, these are the two we actually saw fucking. We didn't see them I fucking. I didn't see her bare ass. No, but they were fucking in the yeah, tent. Yeah, but they were fucking, but, I mean, you could, you could, you know, okay, I'm jerking off. No, 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 no. But I'm saying if they, they felt like this couple was the one that we needed to have, like, the, uh, yeah, yeah, we needed you. to see them having sex. No, we don't need to see your Muppet babies being born. I was 
Daryl Hall, man. Or John Oates. John Oates. Which I'm only Yeah, that's exactly, that's exactly what it looks you like. You make my dreams come true. Yeah. Ooh, 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 he's low rent John Oates, though. He also I mean, kind of looks like that guy that sings that song where he's like, Ain't nothing gonna break my stride. Matthew Wilder. Oh, <laughs> no, 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 don't, don't talk down on that one, dude. No. no. I'm not I'm talking down on that one. Dude, and you, you know what? Like no, nobody's gonna talk down on John Oates either. I will. Okay? No. We ain't talking about. No, no. We ain't talking about about I didn't even realize we were trashing on anything. You want to trash? No. I didn't want to trash on either one of those, though. <laughs> I want to trash on her fucking head, dude. I like him. <laughs> oh, wow. What is he doing with the axe? And why would okay. you attract attention, you stupid broad? Right, because she's not gifted. It looked like she was about to, like... It looked like she opened a Christmas present, and then it was like... Yeah, because her face is so Mabel. She's got that <laughs> she was like... <laughs> yeah. No, but, then it, but then it was like it was her best friend's head was in the, in the present. <laughs> yeah, What's like, in the box? Like, yeah. happiness, surprise, <laughs> What's and in fear. The Happiness, surprise, and fear are all the same expression on that face. It's like it's that a, face can only do so much. <laughs> it's a Red Ryder BB gun and then no, it's your mom's fucking head. That's a little, you know, one thing I'll say is that's a little too milky. Kind of, too. It is. I don't know, it's like a strawberry quick. I guess it's kind of like that stuff. Reminds you of your childhood in the 80s. It, it's cool to, right, it's like cool to passion. spread among, you know. Right, like, like this isn't. I'm not gonna get a jug of this and be like, "Here's no. my Saturday night." <laughs> <laughs> strawberry quick, but it's, fun, but it's fun to get a mason jar of strawberry quick moonshine and pass it amongst your friends. Yeah, no argument. And then watch oh. Mr. Miyagi meets fucking Christy. <laughs> that does for Mr. Miyagi. Don't That's a good. That's a good call. Yeah, but the blood stain on the floor. Yeah. But they don't see that. I'm waiting for the truck to start up. No, and see like, now. <laughs> Stop playing. Well, so my only, my remember, when he fuck, is... remember when he fucked those two guys up at the beach? Yeah. Well, I guess he hit the beer cans. He didn't have to fuck them up, did he? Remember those guys that was fucking like Mr. Miyagi at the beach? They came up to him and he took that beer can. He's like, Gah. Like, even now, she looks like she's Never. somewhat like oh, happy. Oh, oh. Hey, hey, remember, wait, uh, are we gonna Daniel die? Song, We're not gonna die. Ah! Up. All she has to do is open her mouth you and you she goes, the Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Mr. No, Mr. Miyagi has all is, these guys are drinking these beers on his truck. We'll have this conversation right now. This is, uh, this this is, is one of the most like, uh, genuinely oh. like Yeah, and they were like, oh, 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 like you know, scary not scary, but like, you know, unique parts of this movie. They don't see the blood on the front of the truck. We see it, they don't see it. Yeah. They also know that the truck has a problem. How do you Okay, there you go. Right. I was gonna say, how do you not it was right in front of you. Yeah, but they walked around the other side. They walked around the other side, and they know they know that they have to do something to fix the truck ninety percent of the time. Oh shit! I thought the car had a fucking period. So was the hood like um, now, with razor blades? I guess so. I, I wouldn't think to do that. I would I wouldn't have gotten a blanket. I would have. No. I, I, okay, but here's the thing too. You didn't fix the truck. The truck's yeah. not starting not because her head's in it. But because of the solenoid or the car for yeah. So you still didn't actually fix it. <laughs> she looks yeah. like she got a call back as Jackie, as Roseanne, fucking youngest. <laughs> it's like her teeth are she like. Does, yeah. her, there's something. It's just her mouth is so weird, and her nostrils. Yeah. They just keep looking up her nose. And so is the so is the fucking sweater vest. Yeah. She's got teeth like yeah. the lead singer from Alice in Chains. It's just like people have that like small teeth. Yeah. It's it, it's just like it's almost like two white strips of oh, come on, veneer or something. You know when I go to work, I cage my dogs, and I'm like, I'm the dog <laughs> in the box. <laughs> 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 See, like, I like this shot, except for they just the design of Madman. He needs to be shrouded, and this is where they start showing just a little too much of the old Madman. And this is why you need to direct Tim Roof. Ah, uh, shameless yeah. plug. We're doing a movie. I know someone that may have contributed to it. I do too. <laughs> I know a couple fucking people. <laughs> so, Tim Roof, watch it. Well, we well Anna Rebecca has a uh, madman shot in her movie, The Bombers. You 
for the Mandarin yeah. shot. Oh yeah, there's a really good Mandarin shot. Yeah. One of my favorite shots. That, where Rick's yeah, where Rick's at the top of the stairs and opens the Shut the fuck up. Just yeah. shut the fuck up, you cunt. There's a creepy fucker in that movie that somebody in the room kills. And you know what? There's a Dude, creepy motherfucker that you. creeped out the young actress who, oh. who now is okay with him because now oh he's holy God. shit man. Yeah. Oh she was God. she was oh, creeped she out. Was fucked up, by me. Oh yeah. my god. Yeah. I and we were like, no, 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 no. I felt terrible about no, that. No, that means you did a you're, good job. You're yeah. a creepy I, motherfucker. Well, I know, but you Jesus can be. And, but, you know, understand the power. You, know? <laughs> yeah. you, you fucking did good. Okay, wait, let, let, let me put it this way. She, like, was cool and okay with, like, Rob, who yeah. scared the waitress at our restaurant today <laughs> just by being himself. But yeah. she was I terrified by you. Yeah. Okay, so the waitress comes over and looks at me and goes, do you want another beer? And Rob goes, no! <laughs> and she doesn't quite get the wit, you know? And like, I'm like, okay. No! Let's not, let's not scare the waitress, okay? I not scare her. Oh, she got, she got the humor. Come on. She did, but she jumped. But yeah, well, oh, yeah that was the fucking point. When we were at RaptorCon, I saw how they'd be here like handholders, because... She wanted me to like chase her around all over fucking the con, so. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, there's a lot of, yeah. Yeah, she's, she's a <laughs> I don't good I they should have showed him running. She's a good kiddo. Like, how is Richie still alive? How? Like, how? He still hasn't found the apple pie, obviously. Ignorance is bliss. Oh, let me go oh, back oh, into the we fucking. we had a whole conversation about oh, that God. the other night. Oh, God, you, oh. Dude, I would love to be just blissfully ignorant. I would love to not have to worry about stuff and not, have, not be a thinker and everything else. Just be like, everything's okay. Jesus, take the wheel. Like, I'd love to be that person. Yeah. I just can't be. And I don't know, there's some little girl that might be killing me in a movie called The Killing Game. I think, well, I think we switched. That sounds appropriate. 